everybody, welcome to Fishing in White House. And today we have a young man who is actually going to roast some fish for us today. As you can see, guys, he's going to demonstrate. All right, so these are the fish that's there. All right, so this is how they generally does the roasting of fish in the White House fishing village. All right, so this is how it's done. All right, so can you tell us what kind of fish you have for roasting today? All right, today we have all wife. Okay. We have angel fish, otherwise known as panga. Okay. And we have chunk fish. Okay. So which one of them is the chunk? Take up the chunk so the viewers can see. Chunk fish in this one. Okay. So right. chunk fish, all wife, and angel fish. So what we do? Cut the belly. Okay. And load it with season. All these nice season. All right. So what what is it that you have in there? All right. The season now is just natural season. Kelly and onion and pepper. I will check it up with a little maggi. Okay. And eat the spice. Do the trick also. Okay, that's good. Alright, so. Alright, the fire blue. Okay, so that's how it's done here in Jamaica, guys. Alright. Alright, so he's going to put that on. Alright, so it's on the fire, guys. So that's the thing that they're going to use to roast the fish. So it was already pre-prepared, as you can see. And this is the chef, guys. Alright, so he's stuffing the fish, guys. So this is how it's done. Alright? Okay. And as you can see, the first chunk fish was placed on the tin. Alright, so that's how it looks. Alright, guys? And he's stuffing the... Turbit. The turbot, all right, or the old wife. So, this is how it's done. So, he's going to put it on the file so it can be roast, all right. Natural roasting, all right. So, this is how it's done. Let me go a bit closer. So, that's it, all right. All right, so who taught you how to do this? Look at you, come find the beach, look two fish, get them cut out, roast them. Full of belly. We don't want one bull or a piece of bread and, and bag juice. So it's a thing we grow right in our whole house. Okay, so roasting fish is very, it's a common thing on the beach. Yeah, natural thing. Natural okay. Food, you know what I'm okay. No oil, no this, no that. It's just natural. Okay. It's a little bit of magic season, you know? Okay. Alright, so you're here, guys. Natural seasoning flavored with a little bit of maggie and everything all right so currently we have three fish on the tin all right so that's what it looks like guys all right so let me go a bit closer so you guys can see and that's our chef and this is how it's done in jamaica guys the fire it's too high so he has to remove some of the wood because it's extremely high all right so that's how it is all right Cause we don't want the fish to burn to over burn because if it does it will taste different the taste will not be the same all right so this is our chef here guys all right so this is how it looks currently all right so viewers you can see for yourself all right that's how it's done in white house fishing village guys these fish they're actually being roasted on the beach side all right so we are currently on the beach all right so this is not done indoor this is not indoor cooking this is actually cooking on the beach all right using whatever resources is available at hand to make a meal in its in its natural state so this is what it looks like all right so i just decided to film so you can have an understanding and an appreciation of how fishermen operate on the beach or within their own fishing village all right so guys look at this this is what it looks like so that one starts to change color all right as before this is how it looks all right and when it was turned over that's how the skin looks all right so that's it and our chef is still busy stuffing stuffing the rest of the fish that's here all right and he's moving very quickly all right remember guys he's using what is available all right so this is not some posh cooking 
but make do with whatever resources is available all right so that's how it is at times as a fisherman all right yes we have to improvise and use what's available all right so he's currently still in action roasting the fish so how do you know when they're ready to eat uh, when they're ready to side burn i sink in i understand you have a little traffic for them right? okay yeah, right. No, I season a lot. Okay, so what kind of lobster is that lobster? This is eventually I want patuk lobster. We call him patuk lobster. Okay, why you call it a patuk lobster? I yeah, don't have to ask the whole fisherman. I don't have to ask the whole fisherman. So I hear them call it patuk okay. lobster. But it's not available to sell him like the other lobster. Then. So what we don't know, we just roast them more time. You understand? Okay, so this one is kind of rare in yeah, a this sense? Is, this is a, this is a, a species when it is sell. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's lovely. So you're stuffing. So he's stuffing the lobster now, guys. All right. All right. So he's doing the stuffing. All right. Remember, guys, this is on the beach. All right. This is not in a kitchen. This is just outdoor. All right. So as you can see, everything is outdoor. All right. So he's doing what whatever he can with whatever resources that's at hand. All right. So this is outdoor cooking, guys. All right, natural, 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 and it's outdoor. All right. Yes. Can you turn it over so they can look at it? The face. So that's the underside, guys. Turn around the face so they can look at it. Turn the yes. So that's what it looks like, guys. A close up. All right. So he's going to put it on the on the tin. All right. So guys, this is how it looks. All right. This is how it looks. All the fish and the lobster being roast on the tin in Jamaica, Jamaican style, fishing in White House, fisherman tail, and everything is being done on the beach. All right. So as you can see, this is what it looks like. And our chef is busy. All right. He's busy attending to the fire. So he's doing more than one things at the same time. All right, because we need the heat in order for the fish to be roasted as well as the lobster. All right, so this is how it's done in the fishing village of White House. All right, so as he had said earlier, how you know when it's ready, when they're ready to eat? Two side burn, I them sinking so right away. You know, if you hold it up, you're not getting no bloody water dropping outside. So right okay, away, all right, so that's. That's the chef, guys, and he said when it's ready, it's it not bloody. And we have the eyes, the eyes sunk. All right, so this is how it looks. Fish being steam roast. All right, on a tinning in White House, White House Fishing Village. All right, so what's that? What is it that you're putting on the tin? Fish liver. This, this give a lot of oil. Okay. Keep the tin in mind. Okay, so he add. The fish liver, guys. That's the fish liver. That, that thing that is frying. Alright, so what it does is that it adds oil on the steam rolls. Thinning. Alright? So that's how it works, guys. Yes. So you see what it's doing? Alright, so we learn a trick a trick. I didn't even know this, guys. So I'm sharing so you have an understanding. So the liver add oil, right? To the tinning. All right, so that's our chef, and he's adding the liver to the tinning. All right, there's a lot of smoke, as you can see. So he's busy trying to turn the fish on the tinning, and this is it, guys. Let me go back so you can see. All right, so this is in Jamaica. All right, so he managed to turn one of the fish successfully. All right, is it difficult? Sometimes. Okay. Why you say sometime? Depends on the fire and how you approach it. Okay. So doesn't it burn when you, you're touching it like that? Isn't it hot? Yeah, but not to the extent that you can be. Okay. Okay. You would have the fear of wood. So what it? Remove some of the fire stick. stick. Okay. Alright. You realize that the skin of the fish starts to lift up, guys. Alright, so why, what happened when the skin starts to um, lift up? 
Throwing tail at it, roasting. All right. That's so guys, cooked. when the skin starts to lift up like that, it's an indication that the fish is partially cooked. So this is what it looks like, guys. All right. That's the stage of the tinning. And this is the lobster. The pato lobster. Let me go down closer so you can see. All right. So it's looking lovely. And you realize that the oil from the liver, it's all fry out. Really mild, all right. And it's mild as well. There's a lot of grease on the tinning. All right. So this is how the fish looks, guys. So who 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 taught you to put the liver, the oil on the tinning? Where you get that from? Who who show you that trick? All that folk. How the all the folk show you that? Yeah. Okay. Also, dad, my friend, them, all that folk. Okay, so you see guys? See them do that. Once you grow up in a fishing village, there are certain trick that you will be exposed to. Alright? So he said that he was taught by his uncle and his dad to add the liver the fish liver onto the tinning because it will not allow for the fish to stick on the tinning all right so that's it all right so this is the state of the fish guys that was placed on the tinning so you alone going to eat all of these fish no me, i'm a friend then. yeah your friend then how much i don't eat so much of fish and lobster okay so guys the chef is roasting for three to four persons, all right? So he was tasked with the responsibility of roasting these fish and lobster, Jamaican style. All right, so why they trust you to do the roasting? I'm not the chef, you know? Okay, you're here, guys. So you had experience before? You had prior experience before? Yeah, man, for a little boy, I've been doing this. Okay, so. At the age of nine, ten. Okay. Okay, so you're here, guys. He's no novice. He's an expert, nor apprentice. Just Band learning. <laughs> okay, so he has experience, and they trust him to roast the fish. All right, so let me look at it once more. All right, this is how it looks, guys. Thing is roasting. All right. So it's a it's a bit crowded, but this is the way it's done in Jamaica on most fishing beach. Yeah. All right, so the fishers generally roast the fish and a tinning outside and this is outside cooking all right so this is not done inside of a kitchen this is generally done on the outside and we still have the chef he's still preparing fish all right so we have more fish on the table here makeshift table as you can see guys so he's getting prepared all right so he's preparing the fish the others to be roasted as well all right so this is how it's done in jamaica by jamaicans all right that are fishermen and they're cooking on the outside and the beach is close by the vessels are close by and it's the weather is nice today right because it's outside so if it was raining he wouldn't be able to prepare the roast fish because we are using a wooden fire and it wouldn't be possible if it was raining so he is going to add more fish to the tinning so they can be roast all right so what do you enjoy the most about um eating roast fish belly full so what is it that you generally eat the roast fish with a good belly full okay so what is it that you guys generally eat the roast fish with why I consume no roasting the fish, the oil absorbs, you understand? Me? Okay. It's so it's a healthier option? Yeah. Okay. So let me ask you once more, what do you guys generally eat the roast fish with? Well, they have a thing named bulla, otherwise known as cake. Okay. And bread. Okay. Bami, anything will come across. So which, which is your favorite? Is it the bread, bami or bulla? Which is your favorite? The bullas. Why? Because it has a little blend with the fish. Kind of have a little different blend. So you have to catch the blend, you know? Okay. Kind of okay, so it tastes different. Yeah, okay. Different. Okay. So how many of these you plan on eating today? How many steam roast fish you plan on eating today? Well, about five, six. Okay. Seven or too much. Okay. So you're, you're going to ensure that you get a belly full? Okay. Okay. So is there anything that you want to tell the viewers out there that's watching? 
natural food, get some fish, build up your thing in your backyard, roast your fish them, better for your mother and mother island, mother and Greece and Understand. Okay, is there anything that you want? Is there anything that you want to tell viewers out there about the White House Fishing Village? Anything positive? Yeah, man. White House Village now, a long time we are doing it. And we now stop doing it. At the, at the night, we have the convenience, we have the, 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 we have the access of the place. You understand? We get with gas, we get everything we forget. Go fishing, come back, live your life naturally. That's it. Okay, so I want you to tell the viewers to continue to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Fishing in White House because that's the name of my channel. Go ahead. Viewers, continue to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Fishing in White House, guys. All right? Because we are the only channel that brings the latest fishing activities and tasks to individuals in Jamaica and even overseas, all right? So, guys, this is how the fish look. Ready or not? All right? Ready, yes, ready. so he's saying that they okay. are ready, all right? So, this is how it looks, guys. All right, so remember, it's outdoor. Everything is done outdoor, all right? Everything is done outdoor, guys. All right, so this is outdoor cooking. Everything is outdoor, guys, and this is what they look like still. They're on the tinning, and this is the patu lobster. All right, all right, so guys, look at it. And our chef is still adding the liver. All right, so this is roasting of fish, chung fish, old wife, turbot, and um, the patu lobster. And there are other ready fish available all right so this is how it's done on the beach in white house why that's the white house fishing village all right so this is it guys all right so this is it guys so everybody is getting ready to have some roast fish all right so they use the leaf guys <laughs> on the fishing village as a pot as a, as a plate all right so this is it this is how it's done here all right, so we have a gentleman here, and he's using the the leaf. All right. This is how it looks when it. All right, so this is it, guys. So, all right, so we have. No, very delicious. Okay. All right. So I was even offered a fish, to guys. Look, I have a fish, so I'll be eating this later. All right, so look at this, guys. This is the gentleman that's eating his fish. So how does it taste? Very nice. Very can you hold it down so the viewers can see? All right, so guys, that's it. And it's hot. As you can see, there's steam coming from it. And there are stuffings on the inside. All right, so those are the seasonings that the gentleman would have put inside of the fish. All right, so that's how it's done. All right, so the, this is it. All right. This is how everything is done at the White House Fishing Village. Remember, guys, continue to like, comment, share, and subscribe. subscribe. All right, so thank you very much for showing us how it's done. All right, and this is my fish, guys. I got a fish too. All right, how juicy it is. All right, so guys, remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Fisherman Tail, fishing in White House. We are out. All right, bye, everybody.